guys, this is Apple Rapper. I'm back with Techno Babylon, and I'm gonna pick up where I left off in my last video. Enjoy! You're here. Who are you? Y y you've got to get me out of here. They kidnapped me two weeks ago. I've been forced to conduct research for them in this aerostat. Research? What kind of research? Human experimentation. This poor girl. You see that hardware in the corner? What the hell did you... Yeah. The upper level is clear, but I... Oh. Huh. Gave him a shot in the back. Your problem is, you overcomplicate things. Still conscious? That's how the wetware works. You can't rip his memory, though. He isn't wired. I am aware, Ms. Vargas. Take his weapon. This is something I've been looking forward to for a long time. Ugh! No, you haven't. Baxter was looking forward to it. What's that? I can't hear you. It's quite a powerful paralytic, isn't it? An unfortunate yet necessary part of our mutual friend here's role. My targets have to be conscious when I pull the contents of their minds. I'd love to rip the Regis clean out of your head as well. I told you, he's not wired. I know, but I know what'll really get to him. What's this? An embryo? It's rather a contentious issue for us, isn't it? Rather a bit of history between us over these little things. Oops. Fragile things, the unborn. Don't worry. Plenty more where that came from. I think... This one is going to grow up to be a great success. World leader, Nobel laureate, maybe follow in their father's footsteps. Oops, all gone. Vicky would be so proud, wouldn't she? Kressel. After all, you showed her how important those things were. More than anything else in the world, apparently. Baxter! You seriously need professional help. Sir, ma'am, Smart Cam feed shows another cell agent just boarded the aerostat. Female, about 1.75 meters. Huh. Should have known she'd still be after her partner. Commander, prepare to weigh anchor. Kressel, deal with our new cell intruder. Then resolve whatever issues you have with Dr. Regis. With pleasure. Don't go anywhere. Gotcha. Ah! Wow, nice throw, Chantel. Did I do good, Dr. Max? You did great. I'd better find where Regis went. Hey, stop! What the hell's going on in here? Regis! Regis, can you hear me? Mm. Better figure out how to fix you. Oh, my head. Thanks, Max. Great job saving my ass and everything. Yeah, and sticking me with an injector. You suddenly a medic? Just a lucky hunch. You going to fill me in on what's going on here? Later. Update me on the immediate situation first. 
Well, the bad news is I saw someone escape through the hatch at the top of that ladder. Damn. It sounded like she was one of the ringleaders of this plan. On the other hand, our newest recruit just made her first caller. New recruit. Oh yeah, you're going to love this. Ah, oh, damn it, I don't believe it. It ran out of charge again, didn't it? She must have overexerted herself. Damn it, I had him right here. Whoa, what's happening? The Eurostat's taking off. Where are they taking it? Doesn't matter. Wherever it is, we need. You all right, Charlie? I'm not sure how much of that stuff I was supposed to give you. I'll be fine. You're in no fit state for any more trouble. Stay down here, try and figure out what they're doing with the girl. I'll find a way to the upper deck. Hey, Regis. Yes, Dr. Lau? You feeling any better? A little. How did you know to come to my rescue? I broke their comms channels, figured I owed it to them, cracked the bug they put in my system and rode the signals back to theirs. I'll never be able to figure out how you do these things, Max. Which guarantees my job security. Can I get an update? We need to get after the people running this aerostat. And this conspiracy. I'll see what I can do for this girl. So, Nita Jong led us to these people. She's helping us find whoever set you up for Baxter's murder, right? There's that. And... Max, I haven't been completely honest with you. There's a surprise. Dr. Cryptic has been withholding info. Ah, uh, cram it, Lau. These people, they took something from me. Embryos fertilized by myself and by Vicky, my wife. These people stole your embryos? Your kids? They needed me to get their memory module for them from Vanderwall, and they knew exactly what my price would be. Wait, they tried to get you to help them? They forced me, Max. There was no way I could say no. Those embryos, they were all I had left of her. And because of those people, of all this... I hate to say it, Regis, but you're in serious trouble. They broke you with this. They nearly compromised this case because of it. You should have told me. I'd have done what I could. Nobody could have helped me, Max. I was obsessed. I panicked. I felt like I was doing it for her, for my wife. Regis, I hate to say this so bluntly. Your wife is dead. You have an obsession with these artifacts of her. The garden, the embryos. Max. You need to focus, Regis. People need our help right now. We've been led straight to our lead suspect. Can I count on you to do the right thing? The embryos are gone. He destroyed them. There's nothing else they've got to twist me. Okay, good. Nina's led us right to the Mindjacker? He was the blonde one Chantel took down. I heard him gloat about what he'd done. He stores the target's information within his own wiring until he can offload it. Looks like he's got quite an operation behind him. I guess it's not surprising he's been robbing synapses all over the world. Gotta be for something more than corporate espionage at this rate. So, the Mindjacker tried to blackmail you because you're on this case? It's more than that. It sounded personal. Maybe you've crossed paths before? No, not with him. But the way he talked, it was like he was out for revenge. Not just that, it's as if he were Baxter looking for revenge. That's impossible. Baxter's dead for one thing. Maybe he's his son? No, he's a Mindjacker. When he drained Baxter, he didn't just get information. He got his motivation as well, and it stuck. Sounds like he got a lot more than he bargained for. So, we've caught up with our Mindjacker. We know that he's apparently ripped dozens of prominent individuals in a number of fields. Including Baxter, some of whom is apparently stuck. Question is, what's all this setup? What do they plan on doing with the data they've stolen? Straight neural data is hard to process. That is, unless you've got an AI to read it. Whatever it is, it must involve this girl. Who was escaping through the ceiling hatch? It wasn't the Mindjacker, was it? No. He's the one Chantel caught, briefly. By the sound of it, the Mindjacker is working for her. His work is part of a larger plan of hers, then? Possibly. She's the one running this lab, for sure. Chantal's really pulling her weight in this job. It's a shame it couldn't hold down Kressel, the Mindjacker. Hey, cut her some slack. She took down two heavies on the tarmac. I'm not going to make any promises about taking her on full time. 
You're just worried about synthetics stealing your job. You may as well take this now. You seem to be the maid wrangler. So, this Kressel guy, the Mindjacker, he killed Baxter? And by the sound of it, ripped the contents of his mind first. Hmm. When I saw Baxter's head, I thought that either his killer really hated him. Like I would. Or he was covering up evidence of a mind jacking by destroying his brain tissue. It's a theory. Sounds like we might be able to back it up. So, what do we do from here? Now we know this is where the mind jacker's operating from. We need to find out what their plans for all those stolen memories are. We'd better find out where this aerostat's going, too. The best way of covering all those would be apprehending these people. Central's gonna be pretty pissed about this. More than usual, I mean. Is it working again? Yeah, we fought off the intrusion. Damn. I was hoping they'd broken it permanently. Nah, we could handle it. It was a weird attack, though. Like, they knew exactly what they were doing. Well-trained hackers. Foreign intelligence? No. Better than that. Like, they were intimately familiar with Central. Then, as sudden as it had started, the attack halted about 18 hours later. Any idea who the Thrall in Skanto Blue is? Not a clue. She must be important to their plan. Maybe she just wandered into their airfield. A useful test subject for whatever this is. She was at Cell earlier. She'd been... targeted. They must be after her for some reason. I'll do what I can to keep her stable. Do your best, Regis. Hmm. What? She looks familiar. I can't quite place her, though. I guess I see too many thralls. Any idea what all this hardware does yet? Not sure. I can't access the terminal. Sounds like you need a specialist. I'll tell you what I find. Find anything useful yet? Just a length of cable. Why would I need a steel cable? You're the tech, you figure it out. I also picked these up while I was finding my way in. Now that's more like it. Any idea how many heavies they've got left? At least two more, but I don't know for sure. Me neither. They've got some pretty slick encryption on their comm traffic. Are you saying that even you can't breach it? Not remotely. But maybe if I could find something connected to their comm network. I'll check in later. Excuse me? Hello there. Who are you? Allow me to introduce myself, my dear. My name is Dr. Baxter. I operate the cataloging station. Baxter? Dr. Adam Baxter? I believe so, yes. Excuse me if this sounds a little rude, but aren't you dead? How do you mean? Well, yesterday I was probing your well-preserved remains at a crime scene. Oh, yes. You're quite right. I was killed, wasn't I? It's strange, because... I could have sworn I was the one doing it. Not the blonde man? The mind jacker? It was definitely him, no doubt about it. One can't exactly commit suicide with a hammer, can they? I'm aware that I was murdered, but I have a surprisingly vivid memory of it. You remember being murdered? Not precisely. It's as though it were an out-of-body experience. I have memory of watching the hammer striking from above my hands his hands so bloody it's all very peculiar isn't it and you see no difficulty between being dead and talking to me that is most odd do you know a dr regis i know two in fact charles and viction hmm i killed viction didn't i so i've heard it's very peculiar. I remember that I did it, but I can't recall the deed, nor my feelings on the matter. You feel nothing? I know I ought to. An act such as that would be emotionally weighty, but all that remains is an absence. Do give my regards to Charles if you see him, though. Can you remember who killed you? It was the blonde gentleman, wasn't it? Though I can recall it in the first person, I'm certain it was him. How so? He was my only company in the room, and I do not recognize him. I also realize how absurd the idea of my having committed this murder would be. Do you know why he murdered you? At first, I don't believe it was to have been a murder. 
This gentleman had larceny in mind. I recall his feelings so much. Mind jacking. He was stealing the contents of your neural wiring. Your brain. Quite so. I was, after all, a leader in my field in the day. And while my memory was doubtless useful to him, he found something unexpected. A well of motivation, suppressed by years of therapy and technological intervention. Your anger against Regis. He took my mind. No doubt he acquired that as well. How do you feel about Dr. Regis? Charles Regis? I feel nothing, particularly. I regret his decision to remove the embryos from the program, but... Nothing else? No anger? No revenge? None at all. Maybe it's the influence of the neural governor on your behavior. By no means. The weight of that cruel apparatus has been lifted. I guess because you're no longer attached to it. And yet, I feel nothing that would warrant it. Why would anyone want to keep that part of your mind? What use would someone have for your desire for revenge? Perhaps it isn't a matter of his need as the desire's need. Though suppressed by the governor, my thoughts on the matter were all consuming. Now they have found a conduit through which they may act. The mind jacker isn't in as much control as he'd like to think then. This might sound like a really stupid question, but what's death like? Hmm. I can see why this would be a useful matter for scientific curiosity. In my case, I'm afraid it's probably not representative. After all, can I really be said to be dead when my memory, my consciousness, lives on? I suppose all you could remember would be the physical destruction of yourself. And that, most assuredly, was a great discomfort. Thanks for the help. You are most welcome, my dear. Please acknowledge. Central Systems, standing by. Dr. Lau, has progress been made in your attempt to locate Dr. Regis? Uh... Yes. He left a message for me at the growth lab. It led me straight to him, in the abandoned factory district. And you did not take him into custody? His testimony suggests that he'd been framed for Baxter's murder. It also appears that something more serious is underway, linked to the Mindjacker. You believe him? Plans are in motion that may threaten the security of the entire city. I can't quite explain how at the moment, but together, Regis and I... Please, Central, trust me that I know what I'm doing. Acknowledged. Retasking asset. CS Lau M. Reactivating asset. CS Regis C. Continue with investigation of potential citywide security threat. You're okay with this? Analysis of Dr. Regis's behavior does not suggest a high risk index to public safety. The only likely target of his aggression would have been Adam Baxter, deceased. And he's been resolved. So you don't think Regis did it? Whether he is responsible or not can be determined more thoroughly through forensic analysis. He does not pose a threat to others and his continued presence suggests he is not a flight risk. In addition, his skill as an investigator will aid in resolution of more serious matters. Huh. Sometimes you have a really strange way of looking at things, Central. I have a holistic point of view. I can see the big picture, as you might put it. Please continue your investigation into anti-civil activities underway. Any further update on last night's heuristic attack? No conclusive information has yet been discovered. It appears to not merely have been a DDoS attack coordinated by a large number of systems but one targeted precisely to a vulnerable junction. As if they had inside information on where to hit? It would have required up to the minute data on central system activities. Hmm, this is looking more and more like an inside job. Perhaps. Investigation of suspected parties will be commenced. Tell the Snatch teams not to be too rough. I want to speak to them as well. Central, where are we? I have been able to locate the aerostat by triangulation of your own systems. It can't hide this time. It appears that you are aboard an aerostat XAN-78, loading register flight plan. The planned course appears to match your current heading, azimuth, 86 degrees, speed, 45 kilometers per hour. I cannot locate Dr. Regis. It is possible that he has had his traveler modified. Sounds like something he'd do. 
He's here with me. We're not sure where they're headed yet, but they're armed to the teeth in here. Interceptors dispatched. Contact will be made before the aerostat reaches the coast. No further updates. Just checking in. Confirmed and noted, Dr. Lau. Please proceed with your investigation. I wonder what this was for. That's one. That's another done. How many of these things are there? General alarm. Starboard control services compromised. their comm system. Now it thinks my traveler's part of their network. Cobalt 3, this is actual. Do you, uh, copy? Over. Cobalt 3, standing by. Uh, Cobalt 3, what is your status? Perimeter secure. No sign of hostile. Uh, copy that. Cobalt 3, mission is compromised. Scrub the operation and return to base. What? Negative actual. The old set rep shows objective, not compromised. Damn, worth a shot. Cobalt 3, hostile sighted to starboard side. Copy that. Already in position for a descent. Cobalt 3, this is actual. Do you, uh, copy? Over. Cobalt 3, standing by. Cobalt 3, hostile sighted to port side. Copy that. Moving into position. Identity. Voice print required. Cobalt 1 8 Sigma. Voice print confirmed. Please exit targeting zone. I'm not going. Hey, what happened? Oh, right, helium. 
Cold Alt 3, this is actual. Do you, uh, copy? Over. Cold Alt 3, standing by. Uh, Cold Alt 3, what is your status? Cold Alt 1 and 2 secure. Assets on route to target. Uh, copy that. Cobalt 3, mission is compromised. Scrub the operation and return to base. What? Negative, actual. Nailed set rep shows objectives not compromised. Damn, worth a shot. Cobalt 3, hostile sighted to starboard side. Copy that. Already in position for intercept. Cobalt 3, this is actual. Do you, uh, copy? Over. Cobalt 3, standing by. Cobalt 3, hostile sighted to port side. Copy that. Moving into position. Verify identity. Voice print required. Cobalt 1, hey, hey, what happened? Voice print not identified. No, wait, it's Cobalt 1, eight Sigma. Voice print not identified. Terminating security threat. Wait, stop! Warning, ammunition depleted. Hello? User IFF not found. Consider hostile. Blast that door. Error. Unauthorized user. Oh, so you won't take my orders. I suppose you were just trying to kill me a minute ago. Target acquired. Warning. Ammunition depleted. Entering power save mode. Wetware's not going to connect with that. Everything that was her is now in my pockets. Here you go. Hello? Hi there. Blast that door. Stop, stop, just stop shooting at us. You'll blow the whole damned aerostat up. I'm about to come in. Place your hands above your heads and remain where you are. Regis, I've got the suspects holed up. What's your status? Good job, Lau. I've been doing some digging in here. Apparently, their intended destination is Fulcrum Tower. The tower? In an aerostat? Why? Let me send you the files. Freeze! You're awake. How do you feel? Get nuked. You're the one who tried to kill me in the first place. Why would you say that? I saw the data feed from 14E. You were there. You planted the bomb! Who showed you that feed? Do you trust them? It... I... It's still a pretty big coincidence, you being here too. I'm a cell agent. I came looking for a missing girl. It's my job. All I know is you're still following me and I need to get out of here. Get out of my way or I'll shoot! No, you won't. I can see it in your eyes, in the way you're holding that weapon. You don't want to shoot. You're a good person. You don't know me! Deep down, you know I just want to help you. And you want that help, too. You're not going to shoot me. That's how I... Regis? You still there? Uh-oh. Hello? Hi there. Keep at it. Don't let anyone out. Oh, true that. Anyone comes through that door, Chantel, you make them regret that decision. Got it.
Regis! You just shot a cell agent trying to help you! He tried to kill me! Hang on, Regis. Wait a minute. I know you. You're the girl who was with Dr. Vargas. Galatea, right? Gala what? You all right? I'll be fine. Apparently it wasn't as empty as I thought. The counter must have had a charging plate. More to the point, how did she shoot you with your own signature weapon? I'm not sure. Hold still. Just need to scan you. Um, Regis, why does this girl have half of your genome? What? This girl, who yesterday was introduced as Dr. Vargas's daughter. I don't know what you're talking about. Vargas doesn't have a daughter. Oh my god. My god, he couldn't have. What? What is it? That son of a bitch. I... I know who you are, and I'm so sorry. You can't withdraw the embryo now! We're finished without it! What part of no wasn't clear, Baxter? We've decided not to use our embryos in the project. We'll find another way to do it. You don't know what's at stake! Our reputations, our whole careers could be made or broken by this! Dr. Baxter, we've made our decision. He's poisoned you against us! Don't let his antiquated morals stand in the way of what we can achieve here! Thanks to Charlie, I've seen things from a more holistic perspective. There's more to life than the project. Bah! Thanks, Vicky. Thank you, Charlie. We're starting our lives together, and that's what's most important to me. Ah! Adam, what are you doing? Do you know what will happen when this project fails? There's nowhere left to go for me after this. My career is in ruins. I've no future without this project. Do you see, Dr. Regis? You have ended me! You have ended me! Vicky. My god. So that means that this girl is... They must have continued their research after I left the project. Duplicated the embryo to use as a baseline. Wait. That means I'm your... Oh, Nuke. I think I'm gonna be sick. Max. This is my daughter. What was that? The engines have cut out. Or we've arrived. Uh-oh. Damn, they got passed. Looks like we're not just stopped, we're docked. Uh-oh, I recognize that office. Galatea, my dear, don't do this. It's too late to stop me now, father. Damn it. She sealed the elevators. I'll try a breach. Charlie, we must stop them. I fear her plans risk endangering the entire city. Cram it, you son of a bitch. You cloned my embryos after Vicky was gone. Then you continued the experiments after I was out of the picture. Dr. Regis, I can only imagine how you must feel. What did I just say? You don't get to talk. Max, what do we know about this, about Galatea's plan? Well, she has a dense storage module full of stolen mind states, and apparently she's now taken Central's processor core by force. Maybe she's holding the city to ransom? Like 20 billion quanta before sunrise or I destroy Central? That sounds like a bit of a cliche. Doesn't explain the mind jackings either. Fine, you're the detective, you come up with something better. I fear that I know what she intends. As it stands, Central serves not merely to coordinate city operations. It doesn't? No, Dr. Lau. In fact, this may represent one of mankind's greatest achievements. I have been using its position, one of absolute trust and resources, to teach it. Teach it? About what? 
about life, the world, the human condition, what it means to share the world with us. I and the city have given it a position on high from which it can observe everything. At the cost of its duties to the city? I believe not, Dr. Regis. However, Galatea shared your concern. She believes it important that Central's intellect be suitably equipped sooner rather than later. Oh, God. Regis, what did we have to do to the maid when we wanted it to behave in a different way? We gave it a new personality. She's taken the mind states of experts across a number of fields. She wants to combine them into a, a gestalt all-knowing personality for Central. Galatea wishes to skip over the years of education it may otherwise have taken and create an all-knowing leader for the city overnight. With a combined experience of about eight centuries from the mindjacking victims. Please, you must stop her. She'll have to upload the soul personality from the Cortex matrices at the top of the tower. We'll stop her, but I'm not doing this for you, Central, or the city. It's for the people whose lives have been the cost of your glorious work. For Vicky, for our kids. Come on, Lyle. Nina, I did not know you were still here. Nobody else is doing any work. It looks like it's up to me to salvage this project. Don't get me wrong. I appreciate your attitude. But we have lost half of our team in one fell swoop. Poor Viksha. I cannot say that I blame Charlie for removing the embryos from the project after that. Mm-hmm. Embryos. I know that look, Nina. There is something that you are hiding. Maybe. My god. This data. You... Here's the thing about embryos. While they're at the six to eight cell stage, they're very easy to split. It's been the basis of cloning for a century. It's how twins are made. You duplicated Fiksha and Charlie's embryo. Mm-hmm. He's happy he's got his embryo back. I'm happy that I've got another three full embryos to continue the project. I'm not sure what to say. Say thanks to me and say nothing to Charlie. When Central is born, he'll assume we found another solution. This can just be our little secret. Conduit Alpha, temporary shutdown. Reactivation in 30 seconds. No way in hell I'm getting in that thing. I've had enough of this stuff. We're getting a signal. The antenna's broadcasting. Now use the controls in the turbine room to give us access to the tower's security. Excuse me. What do you want? I just wanted to say about what happened earlier. Hey, get nuked! You tried to kill me. I didn't know. Yeah, like that makes it any better. And for what? A bunch of embryos? I guess we already got an introduction at Cell. Huh. I suppose we did. I think the tone of that was wrong, though. What? For meeting your daughter for the first time in jail? That's not what I meant. Let's try starting again. Hi, I'm Charlie. 
I'm a cell case specialist. Latha, Skanto bum and trans addict. And apparently the target of a whole lot of people trying to kill her. I'm really sorry about what happened. If I'd known you were there. I nearly died! I've been running for my life because of you! Latha, I'm going to do whatever I can to make this right. Whether or not it's even possible, I'm going to try. Go nuke yourself. The only reason I'm still here is that you don't have a reason to kill me anymore. What are these people trying to do? First, they stole the mind states of prominent individuals around the world. And then, they stormed Central itself. They want to change how it thinks using a combination of these minds? What do they get out of it? Philosophical completeness. This girl's been raised to believe that fostering Central is her life's mission. As she sees it, this is the right way to give Central completeness. And she's my clone. Neither of you is more clone than the other. Apparently, the original embryo was split at least twice. Where have you been my entire life? I was raised by the city. I didn't know. Vargas covered up the theft of the embryos. If I'd known you'd been born, life would have been so different, so much better for both of us. Hey, my life turned out fine. I'm a creator. If kids would have made your life so much better, why not unfreeze the embryos when you had the chance? I was worried. Somehow it didn't seem right. I couldn't give them the life they deserved without Vicky, without their mother. Sounds like you wasted an opportunity. I spoke to that other agent, Lau. What did you think? She's all right. Less of a tight ass than you. I think she understands what I'm going through better. She's a lot younger than I am. I can't wrap my head around this trance stuff kids do. That and she's not the one who tried to murder me. Last time I saw you, it was in the waiting room at Cell. How did you get out? I had help from Jinsol. Who? From Jahelia, an underground network. They're the ones who found out that you planted the bomb. They gave me a way out, and I ran to find them. And they led you to the Aerostat? Actually, from the way they were talking, it sounds like Jinsol was the one who handed me over to them. I'm not sure who I can trust right now. You've got a history with Central, don't you? I was part of the team that created it, along with Vargas and your mother. So you want to protect your legacy here? Not in Central. I left before the project was completed. It was dependent upon them having the embryos. Apparently they kept copies behind to work on. Central's an organic computer? An understatement. Like saying Hanford Mainframe is a powerful calculator. It was designed with a new style of consciousness in mind. If its organic components came from the same embryos, then that means... We're related? Something's not right with Vargas. The way he looks at me. He sees the little girl he's been raising as his daughter for 20 years. He's a monster. How? He just sounds like a soft old man. That's an impression that comes to him naturally. It helps him get what he wants. In reality, his priorities are so skewed he'll do anything he can to succeed. When this is over, we need to catch up. Are you serious? I want to learn who you are, find out about you. You tried to kill me. Now you expect me to just let you in? All right, maybe that was optimistic. But please, once this is done, at least let me tell you about your mother. Why were embryos needed in your, in Vargas's experiments? Embryos were going to be modified to extrapolate neural tissue growth. They couldn't use dummy growth embryos. They don't undergo neural development. And you objected to them using your own embryos. So did Vicky, in the end. Thank you for speaking with me. <laughs> hey, Max. Yeah, Regis? How are you holding up? I'm a little awestruck. Never thought I'd see Central's core. Especially not under attack. Exactly. How about you? I'm fine. Regis. How do you think I'm taking it? I discovered that the man who killed my wife has been after me from beyond the grave. On the plus side, you found you have a daughter. You need to work out what you can do to protect what you have now. Perhaps you're right. If Galatea succeeds, what are the implications? In its current state, Central's behavior is generated from experience. It means that it can be taught. But apparently, Galatea wants an expert instead with knowledge and experience stolen from around the world. Do we actually know that the result would be worse? Regis, you can't be serious. Central's personality would be irreparably altered. 
And Galatea's responsible for the global mind-jacking spree. Don't worry, Lau. I'm just thinking out loud. I don't hate Central that much. What's the situation? Central's lost its connection to city infrastructure. Backup systems are holding for now, so nobody's going to get hurt because of it. It must be because of what they're doing to the core. Galatea sealed herself inside the Cortex processor, at the top of the tower. It's likely she's trying to apply the mind state she's stolen. Trying to alter how Central thinks. Making the kind of governor she finds more agreeable. She can't stay in there forever. She doesn't have to. If we leave her too long, we could lose Central. As we know it, anyway. Apparently, Nina's had people ahead of us already. Inside men, probably. Paid off ages ago. Looks like they haven't finished the job. The equipment's only half deployed. What's it for? It's a transceiver array. Looks like the cable spool is part of the antenna. They must have been interrupted when Galatea broke in. Maybe it's the poor fella who got himself crushed by the elevator platform. She's not going to succeed in removing Central without a working transceiver. We need to gain access to the Cortex core. Galatea sealed in. What can she do from in there? Not much, except tamper with Central's cognitive processes. So, exactly what she plans to. Precisely. We need to get in and stop her. Part of her door security is likely system-based. Beyond my level, though. We need to find someone who can hack. It's likely got redundancies that rely on external power. Let's look for those as well. We might need to split up. We can cover more ground that way. Good thinking. Time's short. We can coordinate our actions if we need to work together. We need to get to the control consoles in the turbine room. Good idea. Then we can shunt the allocated power around. Nina, Dr. Jong, wants power for the tower's transceiver. That'll allow her hackers to dismantle Central's programming. But then, there'll be nothing. It'll be like lobotomizing the city. Temporarily, until they organize a replacement. The alternative would be shunting the power back to Central. Then it could help us break the Cortex Room's security seal. But it's no good talking about it if we can't get to the console. We need to bring him in. I guess this is one of those situations where Central would use the term neutralize. We'll catch up later. Sure. Power system cycled. Reinitializing conduit alpha. Okay, I'm gonna take a break here. Uh, again, if you're enjoying it, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks, bye-bye.